Ernest Simmons Photography, Greenpeace protests, Nestle's Croydon. Hi, we're here down in Croydon, early, early morning. Um, Greenpeace is down here doing a protest. Um, we've got a slogan, give me a break. I'm just going to go there, take some pictures, that try and do a viral campaign, maybe email it to Greenpeace as well, just see what I can add to their campaign. So let's quickly go. they buy their palm oil. We have to make Nestle buy sustainable palm oil. Please help us save the rainforests. Please help us save the orangutans. If we can persuade Nestle to change the way it buys its palm oil, we can save our invaluable uh, rainforests, our tremendously beautiful orangutans. Our orangutans are being made extinct by the actions of this company. Please, please help us to persuade Nestle to buy palm oil from a sustainable source. Please help us to persuade Nestle to protect our orangutans. Thank you. And we're here with Ian, he's one of the um, orchestrators of this event. So um, Ian, would you like to demonstrate and let people know basically what's going on or what the um, demonstration is actually about? Yeah, we're here today to uh, start a new international campaign um, targeting Nestle. Uh, Nestle is buying palm oil from suppliers who are destroying rainforests and orangutan habitats. We're here because Nestle has uh, ignored our calls for them to end these contracts, despite the fact that many other companies like Unilever and Kraft have already done that. So uh, we're here today to say, Nestle, stop buying palm oil from companies that are destroying the rainforest. So how many times have you contacted Nestle regarding the situation of the, uh, the, the palm oil? Yeah, well we've contacted them about six times over the last few years. Um, specifically we contacted them at the end of 2009 when we released new evidence about um, Nestle's suppliers. Funnily enough, Unilever and Kraft have since cancelled their contracts with the same supplier, but Nestle continues to ignore uh, ignore who their suppliers are and continue to trade with them. And is Nestle the only company in the UK that's using this particular supplier that's obviously damaging the um, They're the biggest. They're, they're, Nestle is the biggest food and beverage company uh, in the world, um, and they are um, uh, they're using. Uh, huge amounts of palm oil, so they're saying to them, look, you're in a position of responsibility, uh, you're, you're a big company, your actions can have a huge impact on, on the rainforest. So that's why we're here talking to Nestle. 